Hello, welcome to my channel, Claudio Mir here again. Let's talk today about Hike Vision default ports for NVR, DVRs, and cameras. As you can see, I have my NVR via web browser, and we can check the ports that the NVR uses. On configuration, you can check this information on the network basic settings port. So basically, you have the HTTP port, that's the 80, you can access via web browser. RTSP is 554. When you're using third-party software, let's say Blue Iris, for example, you can use RTSP to connect to the, to the NVR or to the camera. And I have another video here in the channel that I show how to do that with the Blue Iris software using port 554 for RTSP. HTTPS is for secure connection via web browser. So the port is 443. And server port, it's 8000. So for this NVR, if you want to connect uh, using High Connect, for example, you need to use port 8000. Let me just show how it works. So I have the High Connect app on my mobile phone. When I click here, menu adding, I need to type the IP address. So I check here IP address and just input the IP address of the NVR. And the Hacky Connect assumes already that I'm going to use the port 8000 because that's the default one. And then here I have to input my username and the password. And of course, it's a password just for a test. It's not my regular password. And I come here to the top. I can change the name if I want to. Let me just put here something simple like Hike in VR and I hit save. I click and start live preview and I see the image from the camera. Okay. I just move my hand in front of the camera here. You see it's live. So pretty simple. This is for port 8000. Back here to the NVR interface, we see that we have the NAT. So if you're going to use your router to go to the internet, you have to use the NAT ports. You hear, here you can see port 80, 554, 8000, 443. Okay. You can configure this in your router to have external connection. And you can also use uh, UPnP if you have your router with this function enabled there, this, this, with this feature enabled there, you can use UPnP, okay? And the same is for cameras. If you want to use your camera, you can log in here and take a look. Here we go with my camera. I need to go to the same configuration, network, basics, and ports. So you have port 80, 554, 443, 8000. If you're a developer and have some software that you want to connect to the camera, you can use 8443, 7681, 7682, and also multicast. For multicast, you have port 8860 and 8862. So it works. You just need to use those ports. Let me just show an example again with the NVR, with the port 554, for example, for a TSP. If you want to use a, a software, let's say a third part software, you can get a stream via RTSP. As you can see, I have the VLC player using port 554 here, okay, to connect to the camera. You come here to media, open network stream. Here's the RTSP command, username, password, just for test, of course, the IP address and port 554 is here. Let me just change to another channel so you can see that I'm connecting to a different channel here using port 554 for RTSP. When I hit play, the software connects to the camera directly using the, this port 554 for RTSP protocol. So it works pretty fine, okay? So guys, that's all for today. Now you have the ports for your NVR cameras and DVRs. If you like this video, please subscribe to this channel, leave your thumbs up and your comments. I see you in the next one.